Hello and welcome to this series of short videos which will be accompanying my album, Invisible Music, folk songs that influenced Angela Carter. Hello, for this video I'm focusing on tracks 16 and 17, the song Rainadine and an extract from Carter's debut novel Shadow Dance. And I love this pairing because there's something of a foxy villain lurking in both of them. And in fact, Carter wrote Shadow Dance at the height of her folk singing practice. So it's not really surprising that there's quite a lot of bleed from her folk singing into her writing. Rainadine tells the story of a mysterious vulpine hero, Rainadine, who uh, Bert Lloyd used to sing this song because he could link it with Mis Mr. Fox, that fairy tale, with the buckets of blood. And apparently he did this fantastic 15 minutes sort of set piece where he'd do the tale and roll into this song, Rainadine. Rainadine lures his victim over the mountain to his castle. And it isn't really made clear what happens to her, but you know, we kind of know it doesn't end well. But Carter wrote a villain in her novel of the time called Honey Buzzard. That animalistic character name gives away to me that there might be a link between Honey Buzzard and Rainadine, with his Reynard foxy name as well. And the description of Honey Buzzard is just extraordinary. It sounds like Reynard, Reynardine just walked out of the song and straight into Carter's novel. He's got pointy ears that are a bit furry, he's got carnivorous teeth. And the point about the teeth is interesting because Bert Lloyd slightly tweaked the song to emphasise his sharp teeth. And Carter makes a point of emphasising Honey Buzzard's teeth too. Apparently he has a mouth that looks like it eats meat, rather sinisterly. So I feel that foxy villain from the song padding around in Carter's novel. <laughs> 